fun time, you know, playing Jerome, and, and I look forward to the story and the character evolving, you know. Are we going to see a softer side of him since we see him as this, like, tough guy I, the whole time? I don't know. Whatever's got those those writers have, have uh, in store for us. But I don't know. I, I think that, you know, he does have that tough tough exterior but i think we do know what he loves i think we do know his vulnerable points let's see if those things are kind of exploited i don't know have to wait to see well the character will have a lot of depth and you can tell that they they are planning a lot for your character what are you most excited for like what throughout when you were filming the season i mean i'm most excited to see the the stories converge you know uh, that intersectionality of, of the the cia you know with teddy's character and lucia and gustavo also you know so I, i'm just waiting to see all of those things kind of come in and whatever beautiful mess becomes of it i think the audience and as well as the the actors we're waiting to see you know we're waiting to experience that i think it's going to be really cool because we're so developed outside of each other you know what i mean so when that I think that pressure is going to burst a lot of pipes, let's just say. The story delves deep into, like, well, 1983, but the, the, with drug dealing and, and neighborhoods. How important do you feel like the show is for in general? I think it's a, it's a really important show because I think, you know, it's kind of a, a time period and a, and a subject that a, a lot of times is kind of swept under the rug. And we have uh, perhaps a stereotypical look at that. So to be able to look at some characters, although fictional, um, that live during this time and, and bring some humanity to this uh, to drug dealing to to uh, 1983 and this cheap cocaine coming and you know changing a lot of communities um, even till today 2017. I think it's just interesting to see that and like I said, bring some humanity to it and uh, maybe some context as well. Well, we're here celebrating the Emmys and television. Um, what are you looking forward to most when you see the Emmys? When I think of the Emmys, uh, first of all, I think of that beautiful gold woman just holding that, <laughs> holding that globe, that 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 uh, you know spear. I don't know. Um, but I also think about the great performances that we see throughout the years, and um, I'm always you know kind of enthralled to see the the acceptance speeches and what people say and caught in that moment the humanity that's brought out in some of the speeches. Um, yeah, that's that's kind of the things that I think of all the time and, and it's to me it's kind of endearing to watch and there's a lot of humanity there a lot of love and creativity well this season at all this Emmys we it was the most groundbreaking because we saw a lot of firsts happening yeah. in, in the Emmys how did that feel for you when you saw like Sterling K. Brown win again oh yes right <laughs> like we had some repeat winners yeah I mean well you know what I think it's awesome to to just see you know, that diversity and, and different voices, it paying off that, you know, it really is a true representation of what we see every day in our world. And for our art to also be indicative of that, to mirror what we what we see in real life. I think that's a beautiful thing. Uh, Lena Waithe winning tonight, uh, Donald, Donald Glover and Sterling and even all of the nominees and and, and and even the to me even uh, Jermaine Fowler doing the the, the kind of <laughs> DJing half you know like commentator on the side it just brought some comic relief there that I don't think we've seen before I think is a a, a a nice element I think that uh diversity really pays off uh, like I said it is indicative of real life yeah. well, congratulations on everything and we can't wait to see next season definitely I can't wait to thank you yeah, for having thank me thank you.